Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another brand new amazing GTA 5 online video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the god mode glitch and actually have a map, okay? This allows you to have your weapon wheel. You can change your weapons while you're on foot. And this makes this god mode glitch 10 times better, okay? So if you guys know how to do the TV glitch already uh, in the arena, go ahead and leave yourself some timestamps so you can skip to the part of the video where I have already done the arena TV glitch, okay? So basically, this is basically the same glitch, but this is how to get your map with it and all the other things that you need for the game, basically, like the kill feed and all that good stuff. So this allows you to have full god mode online after the most recent hotfixes. So let's just get straight into the video. So gonna, what you're going to need to do is you're going to have your spawn location on bunker. Go to a brand new invite only session with your spawn location on the bunker. Okay. Now once you spawn at the bunker, there's all you have to do is just make your way um, outside. Okay. So you just have to make your way outside. And then we're going to go ahead and make our way to the arena. Okay. So request a helicopter or you can use job teleport for the beginning of this glitch. Um, not for the end of the glitch, but you can use job teleport just to get to the arena for the first part Okay, so if you guys don't want to fly right now uh, You can go to the arena by using job teleport, but you can't use job teleport after you go into the arena Okay, the glitch will not work if you try to use job teleport to go back and forth after you're glitched out Okay uh, So what you're gonna do is you're gonna be using the TV glitch in the arena to get glitched out And then we're gonna be using it to get God mode. Okay, so this is a very easy glitch once you guys get used to it It's pretty easy to hit so I just slowed it down so that you guys would not get confused So what you guys want to do is make your way over to the TV in your arena Okay, so go up to the TV and you're gonna hit right d-pad to access the career wall now you're going to press L1 to go over to the TV and you're going to hit triangle to pull up the leaderboards. Now once you got the leaderboards up, you're going to open Criminal Enterprise, okay? So you need to be on the TV with the leaderboards up. Once you have that, you're going to open Criminal Enterprise and start up Titan of a Job, okay? And once you start up Titan of a Job, all you have to do is back out of Titan of a Job, okay? So you're simply going to go ahead and get the leaderboards up while you're on the TV, you have to press L1 first before you get the leaderboards up, by the way, or this will not work. So all you got to do is start up Titan of a Job and then back out and you will be glitched out invisible with the leaderboards on your screen, okay? So just back out of the job and you will be uh, invisible with the leaderboards on your screen. What you're going to do from here is you're going to make your way down to the spectator box, okay? So just go ahead and circle around to the spectator box and you want to stand where you have the option to enter the spectator box okay so just go ahead and run around to the spectator box and you're going to stand exactly where you have the option to spectate okay so this is a very easy glitch i know you guys can hit this probably first try all right so just stand where it says uh access spectator box and it should give you a alert okay now when you accept this, you're going to quickly press circle and then wait for the screen to get blurry and then press square, okay? So what it's going to be, is going to be X circle and then when the screen gets blurry, you're going to press square, okay? So just go ahead and when you're ready, press X and then circle immediately and it, right now when the screen gets blurry, press square, then select a story mode alert and then decline the story mode character, okay? So hold down on the D-pad select a story mode character and then decline the alert once you do that you are pretty glitched out with a blurry screen you just want to go over here to the soda machine once you get to the soda machine all you want to do is go ahead and open your phone go to play quick jobs and then you're going to go ahead and just select play quick job okay once you do that you should turn invisible you're going to turn off your controller okay so just hold your ps button and you're going to unplug your remote if it's wired if it's not wired, you need to turn it off through your PS menu. Okay, so just unplug your controller or turn it off and then turn it back on and hit right D-pad to get a soda. Once you do that, you are almost done with the first part of the glitch, okay? So it's a lot of steps, but once you get used to this, you guys are going to be doing this 
no problem okay all right so once you got that all you have to do is run over to your blue circle where you arrange your cars and you're gonna hit left on your d-pad okay so just like you selected a story mode character earlier you're gonna hit left instead of down on the d-pad when you get into the blue circle and the, basically what that's gonna do is it's gonna give you the camera as soon as you got the camera you're gonna back out once you back out just get in any vehicle in your arena and drive it out do not worry nothing will happen to it okay so just go ahead and drive any arena vehicle out and you should go ahead and parachute through the map all right guys so this is the new version of the glitch this is after you have done the TV glitch in the arena. If you guys already know how to do the TV glitch in the arena, then you can skip to this part of the video. Go ahead and leave yourselves a timestamp in the comment section so that you can skip to this part of the video. Okay, and also try not to get hit by a truck just like I did. So what you guys are going to do is go ahead and get a CEO helicopter at this point, and you want to make your way over to your bunker. Now once you make your way over to your bunker, you're simply going to walk inside. Now, uh, you need to make sure that you have full beer before you go into your bunker, okay? So before you go into your bunker, make sure you have full beer in your inventory. Before you even start the glitch, make sure you have full beer, okay? So what you're going to do, as you can see there, I hit exit the bunker, and the bunker is now reloading over and over again, okay? So you want to exit the bunker, okay? Now when you do that, you should not actually get a black screen. Your bunker should just continuously reload. After you do that, you simply want to drink beer until you pass out, okay? So just drink beer. Make sure you drink all of each beer until you pass out. And then when you pass out, you simply want to go ahead and make your way over to your arena, okay? So once you pass out, you simply want to make your way over to your arena, uh, and you should spawn fairly close to your arena if you exited the bunker and the bunker was reloading you should spawn fairly close to your arena now basically what you want to do to get to your arena you want to get a buzzard a secure serve buzzard you don't want to go any other way uh, because you don't want to get unglitched okay make sure your matchmaking is set to closed okay I'm gonna leave a comment pinned you guys always are complaining about the job not uh, the job timing out so that's the reason it's timing out is because your matchmaking is not set to close okay so basically once you get in your arena you need a martin mission okay so you need a blue dispatch martin mission or a red one and you're just going to start it up once you start it up you're going to back out and you will have full god mode with the map okay so all you have to do is get into the arena after you have exited the bunker in that glitched out state uh, basically drink beer like I did and then you're gonna spawn by the arena just fly over to the arena just like I did start up the Martin mission once you get in there and then you will be glitched out with full god mode notifications and all with the map you can completely destroy players in GTA 5 online with this so I hope you guys go on to enjoy this glitch make sure you guys definitely use this accordingly um, I don't recommend destroying players in GTA 5 online because that could get you like in trouble, but enjoy the glitch. I'm out of here, guys.